Afternoon dudes, dudettes and dobacks, I hope you're all doing well. Um, just wanted to do a quick review, it will be quick because it's a small figure. Um, I wanted to do this yesterday but I really wasn't feeling too well, um, had a splitting headache, so slept it off, turns out I was just tired um, after a long 10 and a half hour shift yesterday. So it was a long day, um, but all is well now. So I wanted to do this one from the Phantom Menace, this is Rats Terrell and his pit droid. Of course, the character debut figure. Um, interesting picture on the card back, though, de depicting Rats Terrell in his last moments of life <laughs> after he crashes in the tunnel in the Boon to Eve pod race. You can see in his eyes just the uh, life is flashing right by them. Um, it's a peculiar little figure. Um, I'm not sure. Oh, I need it as a new figure, but um, I know I've made at least one of these species before as a Jedi, I can't remember his name off by heart but uh, yeah, like I said here is the back of the card vintage collection number 77 the rest of it's the same as all the rest so yeah, like I said, an interesting choice in image there of him dying, or about to die spoiler alert, sorry guys <laughs> um, but I guess there wasn't any other real scenes where he was in the movie so that I can think of, I'm sure he was there somewhere, but yeah, that'll do you off. Spend a minute talking about the bloody picture on the card. So here's the figure. I'll, I'll show you the pit droid first. Um, this little dude is quite a cool little pit droid. He is a straight repack from 1999. I believe he came packed in with Gasgano or Gasgano, depending on how you say him. Um, that's one pod racer I still need to add to my collection. Um, because I don't have him, I assume he came with uh, Gasgano with the uh, forearms and stuff. So I believe he has been repainted though. But in terms of the figure itself, it is pretty much the same thing as 1999. So he does have the swivel shoulders there, which that's about it. Um, swivel legs and a ball jointed head that does pop off pop off um, so it's not a bad little addition so I've got a few, I've got a couple of pit droids now so um, yeah, I'm not really in a hurry to get any more but if I can manage to snap up that Gasgano from eBay I will end up with another one but that's probably about enough about this guy nice little markings on the top done a good job painting it and giving it a bit of weathered detail so is reasonably nice and what can I say, it needs to be packed in there because all you're getting is this little guy this is a uh, Rats Terrell he does come with a little blaster which he doesn't hold all that well I think his hands are so tiny I will try and get that in there just so you can see but for all intents and purposes I probably won't display him with that just because they don't use blasters so um, pretty nice little figure though, I must be honest. Uh, articulation is not great, but he is a, quite a small little fella, so I can understand that. Um, the goggles do come off, so he does have these racing goggles, which they've done a good job on, so hopefully you can see them reasonably well. That just slots over the back of his head like that and down across his face. His head is a ball joint, so it can just pop off like so. Oh, I said pop off again. Sorry, guys. Um, yeah, interestingly, interesting head sculpt, but they've done a good job. The nice little details and grooves up his, I don't know, would it be his skull, I guess. Interesting shape. You can see across the chest, he's got a, like a little belt, some pouches. Um, a little logo printed on there, you probably can't see that all that well there's a little logo, can't really tell what it is but articulation is, like I said, he has a ball jointed head, he has ball hinged shoulders and swivel forearm slash wrists and swivel waist and swivel legs 
They can have him sitting down. Little portly little fella. Looks like he's wearing a diaper. Or a nappy as we call them in Australia. I don't know. Do, they, do you call them nappies anywhere else? Um, they're not widely well known as diapers. I suppose we do use diapers, but more so nappies. Just an interesting off-topic fact for you guys that don't call them nappies. <laughs> well, that's about all I can say about this guy. Um, wasn't really all that keen on getting him, but I don't know. He adds to my pod races, so being the semi-completionist that I am, completist, completionist, I don't know, com completer. Completioner. Completismal. Oh, I've got no idea. Just ignore me, people. Um, yeah, like I said, he is a good addition, and I'm pretty excited about the new Morhonic figure. Uh, I've got one in the post on the way from eBay seller Tung Hori. Thanks to Sith, thanks to Sith Lord 229 for letting me know about that on Facebook, so, as part of his posts. So that was pretty cool. So that's Rast Terrell and the Pit Droid. Hope you've had a decent look at these guys. Um, any questions, feedback, um, uh, down in the comments below. That would be really cool. Give me something to read later. And if you use the word nappies in your country in place of diapers, let me know because I'm really interested. It'll be an interesting topic of conversation, I'm sure. <laughs> So thanks for watching guys, and until my next video, may the force be with you. Bye.